I. This is naturally for us. And how is everyone? I believe that everybody is blessed. Okay, I'm doing this video for Shayla Edwards. Hi, Shayla. Shayla is a new subscriber of mine. Okay, so I want, I'm going to talk about my locks, because on one of her videos she was talking about she's two years, I think, and ten months. Congratulations. Okay, I know how you feel uh, about your locks. I'm telling you, it's the best thing that you could ever do. Because you're loving your natural, powerful hair. I'm mean, like, hey, I've, I've been having uh, people come to me. I'm uh, four years, and I don't know how many months now. I guess about, okay, four years and two or three months. Two, oh, wait a minute. Four years and uh, I think this is three months because uh, you asked me how often do I retwist? Okay, I don't uh, twist my hair, I interlock my hair. Okay, and I used to um, interlock every two months, but I start giving my um, hair a rest. And so for uh, its anniversary, I said I wasn't going to interlock for uh, four months. So that's how I remember how many months that, that this is going on uh, in August 13th. It'll be the four months, and then I can interlock. So I had an interlock in four months. And you can see, see the new growth. And I'm so excited because if you could see over here, you can see more black. My uh, my hair was all gray. Now it's turning back black. I'm excited about that because if I if it if it goes back black on my hair, I will never put another color in my hair again. Not that I put over the counter colors in my hair. No, I either put. Uh, uh, I buy my coloring from the health food store, and it's a, from a herb, and uh, and I put henna in my hair. That's how I color my hair. But I'm not saying that I will never put henna again in my hair because it's it's a good form of protein. I know that and strengthening your hair. So and amla is a good one too. So I'll never stop doing that, and that's to strengthen your hair. But as far as putting something that color. And the color that you see now up here is from the uh, uh, henna. Okay, so the question that you asked was, how to do I retwist? And I said, I don't retwist, but I do interlock. And now I uh, uh, haven't been, re I'm not going to interlock for uh, four months. And uh, the reason why I'm uh, cutting back interlocking is because I want my hair to be strong. And the more we keep our hands out of our hair, <laughs> the stronger it will become. Um, I was listening to someone, I forgot who it was, but they said you should treat your hair like a delicate flower or satin. How would you take a satin dress? You know, you wouldn't take it and just, you know, use it and twist it and everything. You don't do satin like that. You be, you want that satin to, yeah, to be nice. And you want to be able to uh, treat your hair like that because it's delicate. I don't know why uh, we've always thought of our hair was the toughest, uh, but I'm telling you, our hair is more delicate than any other uh, ethnic group I have. <laughs> and I'm telling you, I've been having people uh, come up to me and ask me, is that your hair? 
and uh, even of other cultures, you know what I'm saying, it's at your head because they're not used to seeing women of color in their natural state. <laughs> so yes, this is my, and I'm loving every bit of it. Like I was saying, for four years, so you two years and ten months, I didn't really uh, notice all the length and the, the way my hair was changing really until the four years now. It's just like it, it's taken off. It's doing all kinds of beautiful things. That's why I want you to have patience. You have to have patience. Okay, and then I wanted to show... Uh, I was um, just washing, okay, first I would do, um, I might do, like I said, a henna or uh, amla or uh, something like that mixture and put it on my hair with uh, black tea, yeah, you know, brew the black tea and then put that in it and then put it on my hair. And, uh, and that's the way I would... Um, put like you know a strengthener on it first because you know like I said I was coloring it and before I had my locks I used to color my hair because I was telling you it's about to be gray <laughs> and now my hair turned back black and I'm 60 I'm going to say 63 okay I'll tell you 63 and my hair turned back black that's a miracle so, so my hair is telling me okay you're doing something like and it's not just what you put on your hair. And that's another thing I wanted to tell you about is how you eat. Your hair get okay, can you imagine? Your hair gets all the mineral vitamins that is left after your body consumes it all. Okay, your body is is uh, getting all the vitamins, whatever you're eating, okay? It's getting all the vitamins and minerals from that. And then can you imagine your hair is last? Okay, if your skin then and your hair is last. <laughs> so I'm telling you, we should be eating perfect. If we wanna if we want our hair to be beautiful, we should be eating perfect. All the fruit, all the vegetables, I'm talking about in its raw stage. All your uh, vitamins and minerals come from that. And then after you do that, you still should take a multivitamin or uh, or some kind of supplement, because I'm going to go and buy me some today, some kind of supplement to, re to give your hair some more, <laughs> uh, you know, power to be able to, you know, thrive. So all the fruits and vegetables you can eat, okay, try to cut out the meat if you can do that. And eat more beans and beans, because I'm telling you, the beans give you protein and your grain and your, um, your your rice, beans and rice is better than a steak. Okay, so so I'm telling you. But then, like I said, after all of that, you still need some more uh, minerals and vitamins. So get you a good supplement. And I'm not gonna give you no prescription. I'm not a doctor, so. You go and find your own, okay? Okay, so now um, I'm going to show you how to keep the moisture in your hair. And guess what? I just learned this myself. I just learned this. Since the summer is so hot, right? So you said you put a lot of water. <coughs> okay, so what I have in here, I have um, water, <laughs> mainly water, and I put a little of Tresemme. And I put a little oil. Now you can put all the different oils you want to put in here if you want, you know. But I just put, let me see, what was that? Um, it wasn't tea tree, but it was something like tea tree. And uh, I put uh, orange oil in here. And that's what's in the bottle. But mostly water. You could just put water. Okay, so what I do is. Because your hair tells you, if it's crunchy, it's telling you, I need some water. 
to hear it saying, water, water, I need water. I'm telling you, it needs some water, okay? And just think about when your lips are parched, your, <laughs> your, your, hair, your hair is protein and it's like your skin. And guess what? Your hair is alive, okay? So it needs water, just like anything else. You have to give it water. Water. Okay? So, what I'm doing is giving it some water. And try to get all up under it. Okay? Okay. So now, you think just the water is uh, enough, but it's not. Because the water is going to do what? Evaporate. <laughs> okay? The water, it's not going to be no more water in a few minutes, you know. And that's, so now we have to work on filling it in. So, you take um, a, a leave-in condition. A leave-in condition. And I'm not going to give you this name because um, this is one of the products that, uh, when I use up all the other leave-ins, this is the least one I like, so I'm not going to give you this name. But it serves its purpose because you want to seal in, you want to seal in the, the moisture that you just put in with the water. So you're sealing it. And that's all what this is doing. <laughs> to seal in and the leave-in should have water in it too. The main part of the it should be water. Okay. So then let's see. I got this to this side. I don't know what this side is. Okay. So then now I go on this side. show you how much I'm using. About that much. Okay. I'm gonna make sure I get the back. But you want to seal in the moisture. Let me get some more. I'm gonna seal it in. Get them out in the edges. Bring it up back. Make sure you get your hands. And then, a lot of people think that the oil is moisturizing. This has no water in it, okay? But it's a good seal. So, now I'm going to add my oil. And I'm telling you, you're not going to believe how soft your hair is. After you do this, get some more oil. Yep. Okay. Now I get some food today. I want to let you know is just have patience 
people wear your hair. And I'm telling you, your hair is going to start doing some amazing things. But guess what? It takes time. I seen this lady in the market, and her hair was all the way down her back. And I could tell that she didn't retwist that much either. And it was all the way down her back. And she said, all you have to do is just keep living. She <laughs> said, keep living and your hair will. I'm telling you. And I told her she was like a, a goddess queen. It was hanging all to her behind. A black goddess queen. So, so I'm telling you, your hair, uh, you're saying your hair is thin or whatever. But I'm telling you, it's going to do some amazing things. And you're going to see some beauty, but guess what? Your hair has to know that you love it. Well, I know you love your hair. I'm telling you, locks is my dream hair. Yeah, I remember when I was little, and, um, you know, when you put that towel on your hair and you're throwing it all around. That's, that's how my my locks are. That towel was not uh, real um, straight or nothing. It was thick, right? That's how it feels around my neck. That thickness. <laughs> so I'm enjoying my locks. So I just made this video just for you and every other woman that is locked or not locked. Just love your natural hair. Because I'm telling you, people are watching. And they think you look gorgeous. Okay? So be you. That's all I have to say. To, I hope I'm pronouncing your name now. Like Sheila, Edwards, and all of my other YouTube family and ladies. Okay? We have a blessed day. And I'm telling you, just have patience. That's the main thing. Just have patience. And your hair is going to love you back going to talk to you. And then once you feel it, and all oh, it just feels so soft right now. You say, yes, thank you for the water. Thank you for the drink. <laughs> okay. Be blessed. May the Lord bless you and keep you. May the Lord make His face shine upon you and be gracious unto you and give you peace today. Bye, Sheila.